Sagan. What is going on guys and girls, Kaden K here at your service and today I'm going to be showing you guys an in-depth guide on how to turn on the power in Zetsubo Noshima in the brand new DLC map Eclipse. Um, there are a few guys up on YouTube that show you how to turn on the power but it doesn't show you how to turn on the power fully because those guides only show you how to turn on the power temporarily. So I'm going to be showing you guys how to how to keep the power on and how to find it so first what you're gonna need to do is you're gonna have to find uh some type of bucket this bucket is one of the most important part in turning on the power because you're gonna need it in the near future um first you're gonna need to go to two locations um these locations are some type of um towers over over overwatch towers that overlook the map there's two of them and each side of the map and you're gonna need to go to two of them but before you do that you're gonna need to acc accumulate a certain amount of points in order to open a certain door so you're gonna need to accumulate those points first then you're gonna want to go to this area that looks uh, that looks if you're going on the right side first you're gonna want to go to this area that has green looking water this is this is 115 um, radiated water um you're gonna need to pick that some of that water up with the bucket and head up to the tower on the right side and place it in the generator and that would activate that the power on that side of the map now you're gonna have to do that same thing on the other side uh, with with the the other side with the left tower um, tower a and you're gonna be looking for radiated water that looks like that is the color of blue and you're gonna take that same water and pour it into the generator then you're gonna activate both sides of the map now what now what people are doing people are leaving off here but that's not how to fully turn on the power you still have to activate the central power in the center of the map so what that does is once you turn on both powers on either side of the map that activates the door to enter the bunker for the for netsu for netsu boat noshima and you can enter that uh, once you enter that you're gonna want to go straight down and turn on your left that you'll have to purchase that door and that is the main power switch for the power you're gonna want to turn that on but you can't turn it on immediately because you will have to clear some type of debris so you will have to go swimming and clear this debris uh, you have bear in mind you, you you'll be underwater clearing this debris for quite a while and the gates will actually rise and you're gonna need to get some air and we gotta have to watch out for zombies as well so you're gonna need to get some air and clear that debris and you're gonna need to press that button and that will activate the power for the entire map for Zexu Bo Noshima so if this was helpful to for you guys just leave a like comment and subscribe and I'll catch you guys in another video